Hey, good morning, students. I'm presenting here the following uh, word of the day. It's cell phone. Check the spelling. C E L L space B H O N E. All right. You know you have to go to the Cambridge Dictionary and get information for this word. Right? You have a visual over here, so if you want to put the visual on your PowerPoint presentation, that would be good for us because you will have a visual contact with the um, item or device we were talking about. Um, I'm just going to give information about the pronunciation. I need to practice for some time. Um, I have added information or the symbols uh, that present the phonology or phonemes of each word. So this is the definition that you have over here, but with normal uh, writing or spelling and the symbols appear right here. So if you want a little bit more practice, so what you have to do is to pay attention to the sounds, produce them in your mouth, and uh, that will help you a lot to reach the normative pronunciation. Okay, so going back to the pronunciation, it's cell phone, cell phone, two syllables, and to try to localize the first vowel sound or right here, cell, cell. It's a front sound. You put it right there in the first chart. In the second chart, it appears right here, cell. And then you have a dip sound, two vowels. For British pronunciation, it will be the schwa sound, uh, and then the u uh, uh sound that will appear right here. Cell phone. Cell phone. In American English, you change the um, one of the sounds in the diphthong. Change uh, the first sound instead of uh, uh, put a all out sound instead of a uh, sound. Cell phone instead of cell phone. And then the pronunciation for American English is going to be right here. Southern. It changed a little bit. All right. Uh, go to the Cambridge Dictionary. Get the grammatical category. Please. You have to write something right here. It's a grammatical category. Think about it. And then um, I just uh, copied and pasted the information of the definition here. But don't do that. Just uh, go to Cambridge Dictionary, to the Cambridge Dictionary, and get the uh, information that you need to describe the this electronic device. Next, I write the examples that will appear in the Cambridge Dictionary and then write your own examples. After analyzing all the information, you are going to be able to write your own examples. Practice the pronunciation with the uh, IPA transcription. All right, work hard and finish this uh, slide on your PowerPoint after you are taking notes. You are going to copy information on your notebooks. Okay, take your time. The most important is to practice, please. Thank you very much. Post the video as you need it or stop the video as you need it. And uh, do your best. See you around, guys.